Welcome back to the third episode of the Axman Podcast. This is your host, Gastelum. And Airman Volk. And Airman Stevenson. And Airman Uriarte. Uh, today we're going to be talking about family day, our goals, and, and stuff like that. But first we're going to have them tell, uh, tell us a little bit about themselves. Let's start with Uriarte. Uh, so, something about me and why I came here. I came here because I was getting a lot of distraction at school. And honestly, I just started getting lost in like probably not bad drugs, but just smoking, just smoking weed. And I didn't really care about like school and all that. And when I found out about this academy, I knew that this was like a better chance for me to like grow and everything. But I just feel like this academy is already making me grow and into a better person. I'm already being stronger than I was. And yeah, I'm just learning a lot from this cadre that they're teaching me. What about you, Steve? Yeah, you got there. I like that. Um, so, something about myself, just me and my mom, and like these past years, like I just haven't been trying in school, and I just, you know, just got the drugs and all that, and it just really just made me go downhill. And um, somebody, like, what's it called? Like, they're like, hey, you should go here. Like, somebody recommended, suggested. yeah, somebody suggested the academy to me. And at first I was like, nah, but then I realized that like it it would, for your future. it would be good for my future. Like I could just turn my life around and get just do better, get my credits, make my mom proud, there's some more discipline. And just I just wanna do good, I wanna be a successful man. Yeah. Okay. I can relate to that a lot too. So how was your guys' family day? My family day was actually really good. Like I got kind of emotional seeing my family. Like yeah, I walked, yeah. I was really nervous because I was like one of the first ones. Oh, yeah. And I walked into the room and I just looked around and at the end I saw my mom. And I just got happy and we went outside. And I saw my family and I just started smiling. <laughs> I started to tear up because like it felt, it's been a while since I like I see my family and it felt good to see them. Like eat food, just hang around, talk. What just have know? a good time and just have fun, eat. What did you guys eat? We ate flautas, oh. some tacos, ceviche. I was eating takis and like some <laughs> chips, <laughs> some soda, but I didn't want to go too crazy because of PT. Oh, yeah. The yeah PT but the PT was, was all right. Yeah. What about you guys? Oh, it's pretty good. My, for my family, it felt really good to see them. Yeah. They were really proud of me. Good to have a conversation with them, talked about really fun, like exciting things. Mm -hmm. And like a lot of other, like, what a lot of stuff has changed too. Like, my cousin got a dog, a little husky. My niece, she was really happy to see me. It was really nice to see her. My sister was really nice to see her. My mom and my stepdad, it was pretty good. And I I got, I got, wanted to call my dad, but it didn't really work out well because the, the service, the service yeah. yeah, the service was pretty bad. But I called him today during phone calls, and it was really good to talk to him. That's good. Yeah. And we ate some, some tamales. My mom made some ceviche, some spaghetti and enchiladas. I, I think I ate way too much yesterday. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I way too much. Yeah. How was your day though? It was pretty good. I, I miss I missed my family. Not all my family got got to come, but my mom, my stepdad came, and I really enjoyed seeing them. Mm -hmm. But I ate like 26 wings. 26? Like, yeah, I was, they brought a lot, and I was just I was going in on it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what about you, Jason? No. I already said so <laughs> I was I was actually one of the last people. There was like yeah. maybe five more people in there. It was... It was just crazy, like when they called and they're like, hey, Stevenson needs to go. I just ran to the room and I ran right past it. <laughs> right past it. I started looking around. But uh, and then everybody was like, hey, come back, it's the other room. And I was like, oh, so I ran back to the room. I saw my mom. I gave her like a, like a straight, like it was like a minute or two hug. Like it was a yeah. nice, it was, it was one of those heart to heart hugs. I haven't got to hug my mom in a long time. Um, my mom, she bought this axe game. It was just yeah, like an axe throwing awesome. game. It was pretty fun, actually. Um, like when I first saw it, I was like, I was like, oh my god. <laughs> and, then, and then I started playing it, and I think and my mom brought me some brownies, pizza, whipped cream, some candy, ice some carne asada, <laughs> ice some takis, some watermelon. Yeah, just all of it. I had some more, but mac and cheese. <laughs> That's just some stuff I can remember off the top of my head, but it was it was good. I had a, I had a fun time. It was overall a good time. So, with that being said, like our next time we're gonna see our family is gonna be like another two months. That's during nice. home pass. Two months, three weeks, something yeah, so like that. Now we're really, like, we really gotta focus. Four days. Yeah, we're my mom just told me on the phone call. Yeah, we gotta really like focus up and like 
so yeah, it's a long stretch. So like, what are some goals that you, the short term goals that you guys want to accomplish? Um, mm-hmm. Like while you're at the academy, what do you want to better yourself for? Uh, I like I want to go home. Oh, we're talking about, like at the academy. Oh, at the academy. Yeah. Just keep on my grades straight. Oh, yeah. Like they're already all A's and B's, and my mom is really proud of me yesterday on the phone call. She was just saying like, she's just proud of me. It's crazy because I never had grades like that. Like yeah, I mean, you were, yeah, I feel the same. Yeah, um, I've always had like bad grades my whole entire life, and like it feels good to have like straight A's. Yeah, my my mom got my progress report, and she she was really proud of me yeah, for it. Really it the first time I've ever had all A's. I only have one B, so. Mm-hmm. I that too. What are your some short-term goals? Some of my short-term goals here is trying to get more discipline and a lot of integrity too. Like I don't want to be lying. Yeah. Lying and like, or just having more discipline and just staying focused on my grades, getting my credits so I can go back and be better. That's just my main goal, just try to be the best I can here so I can be even better out there. Yeah. What about a rank? What, what, what rank are you shooting for? I'm trying to go for a staff sergeant. Uh-huh. If anything, no, I'm just trying to go for staff sergeant. Yeah. <laughs> staff sergeant. Yeah. Yeah. What about you, Steven? Staff sergeant. Staff sergeant. Yeah. What What are some like uh, short term goals you have like after here? Me? After? Yeah. Let's go through. <clears throat> so after, one of my short term goals is getting my uh, license. I want to get my license mm-hmm. so I can start working again, and just work, just save my money, buy my buy. Uh, I want to buy a truck. Silverado, yeah. and just work, get money, just, and also have a lot of discipline to my parents too. Mm-hmm. A lot of respect to them. I feel like you've been disrespecting them a little bit. Yeah, or, like yeah. back home, yeah, it was, I wasn't the best. Lying like, to them a couple. Yeah, lying to them, just disrespectful. Wouldn't listen to them. Wouldn't really care about their opinion. Yeah. So that's, that's why I want to get. A, <clears throat> I want to have a lot more respect to them, towards them. What about you guys, man? Uh, I can relate to that too. I want to get my license and definitely want to start doing better in school. No more skipping, no more, uh, no more skipping, no more doing drugs. And I want to save up, save up for a car maybe, maybe a truck, and join soccer hopefully. Yeah. My, my junior year, play soccer. I want to, uh, when I get out of here, my, my all time goal is to graduate because I would be oh, the yeah. first one to graduate in my family. So I feel like that'd be a, a really big accomplishment. It's not really short term, short term, but it is kind of. It's still like two years, but mm-hmm. that is something I want to accomplish. It's, it would be a big one, more proud. Yes, I feel like. Yeah. What about you, Stephen? <clears throat> I' gonna keep keep up these good grades because, like, I know that, like. If I stop skipping and I stop getting mm-hmm. drugs and I just quit all that and I just cut all that stuff out of my life, that I know that I could succeed in school. I know that I could be a better son. I know that I could do all this stuff that like will help me reach that step of success that I've been trying to get. But like at the same time, I haven't been trying to get like mm-hmm. just like every single time like I get in trouble or something. It's like I'm gonna change. I'm gonna do this. Yeah, I can relate to that. that. And it's just like like this is reality. Yeah, like you can't just keep going down that path your whole life. You have to step it up. Mm-hmm. Like you always say, oh, I'm gonna do better this time. I'm gonna do better. But at the end of the day, you're just like not gonna change. Like you just keep doing it yeah. over and over again. But saying like the short term goals, like I, I want to keep having good grades. I want to get my permit. I want to keep working. Like I just want to keep doing keep good. I want to be the best self that I know I could be, yeah. and like push, push that because like you always have more. Always. So tech started to say, you yeah. always have one more push, one more burpee, one more sit up. Yeah, we can do one more. All right, well, thank you guys for watching. This is the third episode of the Action Podcast.